Hello beautiful people, welcome back. In this video, we are gonna compare if the boss loot is the same or not playing in solo mode versus playing in squads. So sit back, relax and enjoy the video. But before that make sure to smash the like button and if you are new around here hit that subscribe button and be sure to stay alert for the giveaway. Announcement and rules during the video. Solo mode has some really crazy spawns. And now many are camping, so be careful or you will end up losing your gear. If you have not already watched my video on what is the best armor to use, be sure to check it out, hopefully it should help you out a bit. There is already a guy here on the roof, I will just have to wait it out as I don't know how well geared he is. Playing solo mode, you need a lot of patience because people pop out from nowhere, gets really intense. I hope he has some juicy loot. And. I have no idea what is happening. With the base boss lately. It takes forever to spawn, really annoying. Tried to glitch the boss from here. Well that didn't go according to plan. Guess I just. Have to kill it the normal way. To kill the boss quickly and safely, just see how I have done it. The shotgun boss is still the most annoying and the most dangerous. Pretty decent loot. Later in the video, after watching a few clips of killing the boss in squads, I will give you my personal opinion if the loot is different or the same as playing in solo mode. We all know the struggle of having a small bag and so much loot. I wish I could take it all.
Now into some squad games. Note that I'm wearing level 2. So I get destroyed easily. Crazy. See. It looks like a bottle. Mark the location. Can I take? Okay. Do you want a grenade? What? <laughs> what am I doing? You looting first, boss. Let's go, boy. I wish he lost all of his stuff. You want to grenade? Yes, I can. On the stupid smoke. Help me. No. I'm just I'm just Nice. Please drop something. Okay. Nice. Not bad loot. Although wish we got some level 6 or steel front items. Do you want both of the guns? In this game, there are two squads here. One with full level 6 gear. They melted the squad really quick. Sometimes take the better decision to run away and back out from. Fights you can't win. It's kill or be killed, think wisely. We decided to wait here and not move at all till they leave. The boss did not spawn for a long time, so we had to wait really long. Giveaway time. I will be giving away a SKS refined gun to one lucky winner. To enter, you have to be subscribed and comment your ID and type hashtag not dead yet. If you fail to do this, you will not qualify. The winner will be announced in the next Metro Royale video. A ton more giveaways will be coming, so stay tuned and do not forget to turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any.
Damn. Wow. The wait was worth it. Level 6 Steel Front. 2. Get a chance to play with me or with each other. Please join my clan. Also do not. Spam invite. I may be busy with something else. Thank you for understanding. You can. I need follow my Instagram as well for some extra content. Excellent work. Really pleased with this round. Excellent work. I have not been getting many spawns near Razhok, I mainly spawn near the base. Also sorry. That I did not manage to show you more boss loots in solo games. I thought you were killed. Hey, you dropped something. It's not this one. What did you drop? Uh -huh. To conclude if killing the boss and squads and solo is the same or not, I would calmly say that it is just pure luck and random. At times I get insanely good loot and extremely trashy loot in both. Solo and squads. The only upside is that, in solo mode everything is yours. In squads. You have to share it with your squad, and guys don't be stingy, you whole squad has to be. Strong and geared up, if you want to win fights. Fine, you can keep it. A lot of time goes into making these videos, it would mean the world to me if you like. And subscribe. Do not forget to enter the giveaway, it's free. See you in the next one. Thanks for watching.